design and you actually want me to 3D print it for you. So how do you do that? You go down here to where it says Part Studio and you right click or if you're on your Chromebook, you two finger click and you say Export. Once you click Export, yours will first look like this, especially if you've never sent me something. So where it says Format, it needs to be an STL. Please name it something, like something like your name or what it is. So for me, I would say it, call it like T Colette Twitter Logo. Um, <clears throat> so I know your name and I know kind of what it is. Where it says Units, make sure it's Inch. Make sure it's Inches and Downloads is good. So Colette Twitter Logo, STNet. STL, binary is good, inch is good, medium, and download. So we're going to push OK, and it's actually going to download it to your device. So what you now have to do is go to your email. My email's already up, and go to the compose an email or some of yours that looks like a plus button. And you're going to go ahead and type in two in my name, Ryan Colette at MadeiraUSD.org. Once you've emailed me a couple times, a basketball should come up. Sometimes an old picture of me comes up. It should be that basketball photo. Um, and then if you want me to print it, obviously something, say something like, please print. And then down here, um, if you wanted a certain color, like right now as I um, talk on this video, we have just white and pink, but I'm going to pick up some more colors soon. So if you see a color here that you like, you might say, um, please print green if you can. Thanks. Something real simple. So now we actually have to attach your downloaded STL file. So we go down here to where it says attach files. And I'm going to go to where mine is, which is downloads. And I got to find it. Again, I have way, way more stuff than most of you. So I got to find Colette Twitter logo. There we go, and open. And then it should just take a few seconds to load depending how large the file is. Double check, make sure everything's good. And then of course, just click send and I should pop up. And it should pop up on my end within about five seconds or so. So that's how to send me stuff you want 3D printed.